Yo, look at this. What's up everyone, MCI, Jay Ingersoll here. This video, you may have clicked on it if you followed me for a while. EDP Studios right now is put on a definite hiatus. Yo, look at this. Studio, submerged. As you can see, my basement was flooded, um, had ankle deep water in it. I bought this house because I had a basement in it and I wanted to build a studio in there. I wanted to be able to create, I wanted to be able to record bands like I always have and wanted to be able to have my own jam room. I bought this house for that reason. About four years after I started living here, I started getting some water in the basement. The water table is really high here in Michigan along the lake shore. So I dealt with that. Some summers we'd have it, some springs we'd have it, and then sometimes we wouldn't. Three years ago now, I hired a company called Everdry to come out and waterproof my basement that says, oh, your basement could look like this. And it was kind of my fault too. I should have had a lawyer right over the contract. So this company came out, I paid like $20,000 to have my basement waterproofed, you know, so I could build downstairs. Last year, the water table got really high and water started coming up through. So I had to tear my carpet out in the studio. The drywall was ruined. All summer long last summer was spent these guys coming out this ever dry place that I paid all this money to came out and they're trying to fix it do these trench drains and all this different shit that was just blah, blah, blah. I got to move back in in October and I was happy I put some new lights in there recently and everything and I and I absolutely love that studio that's why I bought this house that's why I built that place it was just my sanctuary my office a few nights ago we woke up went downstairs to work out in our home gym downstairs and the water was ankle deep. Their pump, whatever it was, their pump took a shit. Was their backup pump didn't charge or wasn't hooked up right? And it's it's still practically new, two three years old at the most now. They did luckily come out and fix the pump. I just don't think I'm ever, even though I paid all that money to this company to waterproof my basement so I could build it. I just sick and tired of moving equipment in and out, in and out all the time and, and don't know where I'm at with the studio or how long I'm gonna be out of there. So really right now we're on an indefinite hiatus. Let me say this, let me say this. I'm not done, EDP is not done. I am really just stripping down and going with the bare necessities. Luckily uh, this room right here is available in my house, my spare bedroom. Right now it's got a bunch of shit in there. Just to let you guys know, EDP is not done. I'm still cooking up beats. got this little hiccup in the system right now I'm still gonna be working with my close artist we're still gonna be do some recording in here once I get all the soundproofing right producing beat after beat after beat that's my main goal I'm actually editing a podcast right now too Let's see if we get the homie up there Ooh. it's a good one especially for all my musician friends and my drummers and shit that the, this is a dope podcast is be coming out here real soon I'm it's been said that perseverance is the main key to success so all the little hiccups you may have all the little hiccups that i have not getting the views not getting the plays not getting the sales you just got to keep grinding stop doing the same things that you've done before change it up a little bit don't go insane and as long as you change your plan sometime you'll be going in the right direction so much love to you guys thanks for checking out the video really appreciate your support and uh keep watching Whisper sweet nothings to the pistol. I'm about to blast off and blow up like a missile. I see a crystal clear through the rear view. Now